we are at the starting line of what will be a race that is out of this universe. The rules of the race are simple. At the count of three and the flash of my solar flare, you start. We'll be racing in terms of Earth days and years. So best of luck and give it your all. One, two, three, go! And they're off. Coming in first is Mercury at 88 Earth days, 107,000 miles per hour, move out of the way. Venus is second at 224 days on Earth, that's 78,000 miles per hour. Now let's move forward. In third place we have the Earth, that's 365 days at 66,000 miles per hour, that's kind of fast I'd say. Mars comes in next at 686 days at race. Way to the Andromeda Galaxy is a 
distance of 2.5 million light years you now see The next time you go to the store and it seems long That's not as long as a light year as you've learned in this song What is a light year? Well I will teach you within this rhyme Where does one light year start in the vacuum of space time? Orbiting Jupiter, our 12 additional new moons, bringing Jupiter's total moon number to 92. Jupiter reclaims the title of the most moons in the solar system from Saturn's 83 moon count as it orbits the sun. The internationally recognized minor planet center is responsible for the identification of all these moons, I am sure. circumference of 13,200 miles flying around me once would take 23 hours that's a while we are the planets not the solar system how fast can an airliner go around each one of us for fun it's 272,000 miles around jupiter flying around me once takes 474 hours for sure saturn's circumference is 235,000 miles around a jet flying around me once takes 409 hours i found 99,000 miles is uranus's circumference shown here a jet would take 173 hours to fly around me once I share. Neptune's circumference is 96,685. Once around me takes 168 hours of stride. We are the planets, not the solar system. How fast can an airliner go around each one of us for fun? Thanks for watching KLT. Please subscribe to this channel, like our videos, and check out the KLT merch store.